Hello everyone, hope you're all doing well. Well, today I want to talk about how to connect with your girlfriend or wife or significant other. There are many ways that you perhaps all know how to connect with your loved ones, but it is not enough to be romantic or attentive when it is the moment of pleasure or it is the fun time and everybody has a good mood and everybody is balanced and usually things will go well. However, the real connection happens when you or your spouse or your girlfriend or your significant other are in a bit of a turmoil, imbalance on that particular day or days. And that is where really the connection takes place because the other one, the partner, will know that you actually care and your care extends beyond the fun times, the romantic times, the all dude up th times and all the extraordinary moments and events and uh, celebrations and so on and jubilations. It also extends to when your girlfriend is not really in the mood of anything uh, due to many different reasons. Uh, personal reasons, job related, family reasons, mood related, or one of the most common thing that every boyfriend or every husband, most of them, not all, will miss the importance of it, not just in regards to being a good human being, caring human being, but also in regards to connecting with the one that you're so intimate with and you're committed to and in a relationship, in a committed relationship. And that is when your girlfriend is going through her monthly cycle, the period. Usually that's the time that they're most sensitive and they would like to know if you really care about them and love them. And you can show that not by when they're in a good mood and be romantic and do all kinds of things or buy all kinds of things for them or special events that you arrange. It's about those little things that you care and pay attention to when she's going through her period. She doesn't feel that beautiful, she doesn't feel that sexy, she doesn't feel that exciting, her mood is down, neurotransmitters are not really functioning as they should, the hormones are a little bit going through their transition of renewing themselves for the new cycle, and so everything is out of jar. That's when you come in, that's when your real care and attention shows if you genuinely, out of love, not out of, oh, this is something I have to do to make her feel that I really care. No, really care. If you really love her and imagine that you do love her because she's a very important person in your life that makes your day sunshine more than ever before, even when it's sunny, if she's in a good mood, if she's healthy and the things that you guys do together, the plans, they, the support you give to each other. So if you remember and focus on all that wonderful things that she is to you, then you really would get into the gear of really love and care. So you will be kind, you will be attentive, you will be caring, you will take the chores off of her feet, you would do whatever you got to do on that day and make her feel more relaxed and having to do less than any other day that she does and expect nothing from her. It doesn't hurt if you have some flowers in your hand when you go home. It doesn't hurt if you call more than a few times during the day. How are you doing, honey? How is it going? Are you having a good time? Have you poured some tea for yourself? Is there anything I can get you? Just checking in with her, it will let her know that she's not alone in the worst time of her month and she will feel supported, she will feel loved, she will feel beautiful while she doesn't at that time of a, a month. And it doesn't hurt if you come home with some kind of a favorite thing that she always wanted or something smaller than that if you can't afford it and it's not the time for it, but a gesture, a chocolate, maybe a, again a flower, or maybe a ticket to a favorite show of her for a little future time in a few days something that will tell her you really love her no matter what even though if she doesn't feel that beautiful she's not all dude up it's not in high heels and she's not having all these beautiful dresses on and she just doesn't feel good but you make her feel good by your attention by your real love and caring emotions the extent and you will feel wonderful yourself that you feel so proud of yourself that you actually do love her and this whole activity of functioning in a loving manner and extending that energy will actually resonate back to yourself and you realize 
that you really love her and that strengthen that relationship not just in her own mind but also you will see something that you've really seldom have been witnessing from your own actions so don't forget the period time is the time that you can show you really care and that's very important to her and to the relationship i'll talk to you soon